This is Patrick Monroe, financial advisor, talking about the difference between IRAs and certificates of deposit. IRAs are very strong savings vehicles for one reason, the word tax deferral. Tax deferral means that as you put money into an IRA, it grows within that investment and you are not required to pay taxes on the rate of return as well. So therefore, you get compounding within the investment over time. Compounding is a very important vehicle because it allows the money that you have to grow even faster. Taxes is a drag on the investment returns and that's what you're facing with CDs. If you place money with a bank and they pay you interest on that and it's outside of the world of IRAs, then you have to pay taxes on the rate of return. So in other words, a 4% CD will normally cost you in taxes about 2% which means you have to pay approximately 2% of taxes, leaving you only a 2% rate of return. So therefore, certificates are known as certificates of disappointment because you have to pay taxes on them. It's better to have a traditional IRA if it's available to you. This is Patrick Monroe, financial advisor, talking about the difference between traditional IRAs and CDs.